Oh, good it's... uppercut by Jackson. Another right hand lands. Body shot almost knocks Lee through the ropes. Jackson's power is simply oh. devastating Lee. And there's a perfect right hand counter off the ropes. And Benji and Seba stops the fight. What an amazing comeback knockout for Andy Lee. Just what I told you, Jim. Coming to Andy Lee, not respecting his punch of power, not thinking that he's capable of hurting you, and that's what happened. He got too confident at chasing the guy down, who's still very dangerous, and we are right into a perfectly timed right hook. It was too easy for Don Jackson up to that point in the fight, and Lee still had an arrow in the quiver. What an amazing comeback knockout for Andy Lee. And he rescues his career once again. Yes, he does. Promoter Lou DiBella ecstatic as he reaches over the top of people to hug his fighter. Five minutes ago, you wouldn't have given a plug nickel for Lee's chances of remaining a significant fighter in the sport. But this is the theater of the unexpected. This is what one hard shot can do. Here's the replay. Here you see he caught him with the uppercut. He thought for sure you had him. He's wounded. He hit him with the right hand. He thinks Andy is dead right here, so he's just letting go the defense. And he's all out on offense, never even thinking that Andy still has the power to come back. Andy, with the big heart that he has, exchanges a right hook for overhand right, and down goes Jackson. And Benji Estevez didn't bother was it with a count as Jackson lay face down, twitching on the canvas in an awkward position with his right arm under his body. Yeah, because Jackson never suspected that Andy was going to counter like that. It's almost like when Marquez hit Pacquiao. He was so much on the attack that he had no idea that the guy was going to fire back in the midst of his attack. Perfect comparison, Roy. This was an even more extreme version because, of course, Lee was much more badly hurt than Marquez had seemed to be at that moment. And Jackson was be be being even more aggressive than Pacquiao was exactly. at that moment. Jackson was ahead on the scorecards. Lee gets the knockout victory. Let's go to Michael Buffer for the particulars on the KO. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here at Madison Square Garden, the end of this contest comes at one minute, seven seconds of round number five. The winner by knockout victory, Irish Andy Lee. loss for young John Jackson. You love the sportsmanship as the two of them share with each other after the amazing turn of events that took place at the end of the fifth round. We'll take a look at final CompuBox numbers through four plus rounds. Lee landing 41 of 106. Jackson landing 19 more throwing 20 more, landing at a significantly higher percentage. Power shot category, Jackson landing nearly twice as many, throwing 41 more, landing 51% of his power shots. Every once in a while, a guy lands more than half his power shots and loses the fight. Jackson showed you how to do it. Throw costs into the wind, leave yourself unguarded, get hit with a perfect counter shot. Right on the button. 